Hello everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I'll be showing you guys how to make glitter jars. There are three types of glitter jars. They are ranked from most glittery to least glittery. This one uses the most amount of glitter. This one uses a little less. And this one uses the least. This one, however, is a little more of a snow globe because you have to shake it. This is all the stuff you're going to need. A bunch of glitter. These are my colors. Green, white, pink, yellow, purple, and blue. Then you're going to need a glass jar. You're also going to need water. And last but not least, you're going to need a little toothpick. The first step is to fill up your glass jar with water. So here I have already filled mine up. And remember, all the way up to the top, most of it is going to fall out anyway. I have removed all the lids from the glitter. Here's my jar. And all this glitter has to go in this jar. Be careful, we don't want any spills. I have put out a little sheet just so if it falls, anything falls, it falls on this. Here's the jar. And firstly, I'm going to put the purple one in. You're just going to stick it right in and you're going to squeeze it in. And this requires two hands, so I'm going to stop film for, filming for a second and then I'll do it and then I'll show you guys. There we go, all at the bottom. Now remember, quite a bit, but not too much that the entire thing is filled up with one color. We've still got five other colors to fit in. Next goes the pink. I just pushed this to the bottom, like the pink. And now next, we're gonna put the green in. Also, make sure you don't mix them just yet. Just keep them on top of each other. They'll be mixed at the very end. And in goes the green. And there we go, it's pushed in. Next goes the white. And white's in. Next up is blue. And blue's in. There's going to be very little of the yellow. It's not much needed. There we go, as you can see, there, I didn't put too much yellow in there. And now, it's time to get our trusty toothpick and mix. Mix the pink and purple together, and the ones at the top together, and mix until you get what I showed you in the beginning. There we go, it's done. It looks pretty nice. I would definitely recommend that you guys make it. Here's what I showed you guys in the beginning. This was the example. And this is what I just made in front of you guys. So it's not that hard. Uh, good luck you guys. See you next video. Bye.